A Milwaukee child shot because he was with a group of kids throwing snowballs is speaking out tonight. Fox 6's Angelica Sanchez spoke with the victim and his mother on the shooting that is now gaining national attention. Angelica, what they have to say? That's right, guys. Well, local leaders are definitely speaking out against this act of violence. But for this family, the biggest relief right now would be knowing that the person responsible is behind bars. Nick Johnson is just a kid experiencing something no child his age should ever go through. I tried to run. Recovering from a gunshot wound and a graze wound. I had two holes in my coat and then that's when I realized blood started coming out my arms. Johnson was with a group of kids on Saturday who were throwing snowballs on their way to the park. His 12 year old female cousin was also with him. One of the snowballs hit a moving vehicle. The driver opened fire on the group of kids. Johnson says his cousin was shot in her lower body. I saw her walk and she was just looking dizzy and stuff. Milwaukee police say officers responded to the area of 61st and Birch where they found Johnson and his cousin suffering from non-fatal gunshot wounds. Police say children were throwing snowballs at passing vehicles. They suspect the driver shot at the kids because a snowball hit their car. A snowball. I didn't know until two days later. Johnson's mother is outraged at the motive. She had first thought she had lost her son. Him or his cousin didn't even throw it. It was another kid, and they wind up getting injured really bad behind a snowball. It's been a stressful several days for the mother of five. The focus is on Johnson's full recovery. Loved ones are organizing a GoFundMe to help with the unexpected medical expenses. I can't afford it. I'm a single parent. I'm Johnson is grateful for the support and, he's know, received. I appreciate them worrying about me. I thank them. But what would bring great relief in this nightmare is to know the person responsible is behind bars. Turn yourself in and explain why you were so angry that you had to shoot at some babies. The family is saying that there were so many different ways that uh, the person responsible could have approached this situation. We have a link to that GoFundMe page at fox6now.com. Milwaukee police are still asking for the public's assistance. If anybody knows anything about the person responsible, you are asked to call Crime Stoppers. Live in Milwaukee, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. All right, Angelica, thank you.